hello guys welcome to our 48 jquery video tutorial in this video tutorial we are going to learn about how we can get the values of different html elements this basically this work requires two videos two separate tutorials so this is the part one of the tutorial by which we can use the value function to get the values of our html elements in this first part we are going to use three types of elements input field type text the second one has type number and the third one is the text area so we will get to we will get their values by using the value function of jquery so now let me show you how my file looks like in the browser so this is how my file looks like in the browser i have a text box here type which is the type text then there is a input field type number number field you can say it and then there is a text area so these are the three elements i have on my html page let me refresh it so i want to get their values whatever the whatever user will type in in those three elements will become their value so i can get them by using the value function so i'm working in the click event of our button so first of all i will try to show the values in an alert box so i will just simply type alert and now i will show the values of all three but these values could be bigger so i will use three variables x1 so x1 will store the value of the first item so i will select that item by using the number sign number sign item one dot val value function and then there is semicolon again i will create a new variable x2 and it will store the value of second item so number sign item 2 dot value val val function then there will be a third variable x3 it will store the value of our third item so with the number sign item 3 dot val value function from and then the semicolon now i want to show them in alert box so i can just simply type x1 x2 and x3 but they will be shown right after that but i want you know i want the second one to go to the second line and third one on the third line in the alert box so i can simply use with the double quotes dex and uh, slash n and i will put slash n here as well slash n but these are the the variables which have the value so i need to put the concatenation symbol here in javascript the concatenation symbol is plus sign so i will put plus before and after the double quotes n so now the value of our first item item one will be shown in the light box on the first line the second value will be shown in the second line the third value uh, will be shown on the third line in the our alert box so now let's save this file let's go to our web browser let's refresh it and now type some values here so let's say full name and then let's say 35 then text area so i will type just some kind of random text here so now i will click on this button let's see what happened now let's click on it and you can see all three values have been shown in our text box on different lines so this is how we can get the values these are the three items but we are going to cover more items in our upcoming the second part of this tutorial which will cover text box check box and select list so if you have any problem regarding this tutorial you can just tell me in the comments of this video below don't forget to watch our next videos because more important things are going to be covered so Till then, take care of yourself. Goodbye.